Right, good morning everybody. It is quarter past nine in the morning and I am at a wicked job. Um, I was up at five, I've driven a fair few hours to somewhere near London to tackle this. Um, so I'll show you the front drive first. It's all around this property um, and it is amazing. So check this out, this is the driveway. So it's just from this dark part onwards. Go cool and lovely this house is. Got palm tree in the garden and everything. Um, right, I'll show you around here. So this is all being cleaned and re-sanded. Um, I got some upgrades to my pressure washer yesterday. So I went down to PWS um, in Stafford. Um, I've got these fittings here, so I can just pop that out whenever I need to without having to turn the machine off. Uh, quick release on there. And then nothing else has changed here. Um, I'm getting a whole entire new setup soon, so I'll show you that at some point. Now, check this out, look. It's actually really clean here. Well, I say really clean. It will clean up better than this, but um, as we go around here, you can see it starts to get a lot darker. And then look at this. Check that out for a garden, guys. All these walls here are being cleaned up. Um, I'm going to try my best. I don't know how well these will keep. I don't know how well these will clean up, but we'll, uh, we'll make a huge difference, I'm sure of it. And look all that darkness down there. All those black spots on that. We'll uh, try and get all those gone. Um, fountain. I'll show you that in a minute. And again, all around here. All around here. This is probably the worst area, I think. This is probably one of the. Uh, fanciest jobs of the year so far it's such a lovely place uh, right let's show you this fountain then this is probably going to be the real challenge of the day um, I'll probably be here till tomorrow as well so I'll probably be staying over somewhere and right check this out look so we're going to be emptying all of this out and you, as you can see it's just a mess I'm going to have to watch and check there's no newts or anything in there but I doubt it I don't know how they get out if there was so um, it looks like it's just algae and little runners around whatever they're called water boatmen and stuff so um there's a second layer to it as well which is also probably stinks as soon as i start clearing that there's a third layer and a fourth layer so we're going to empty all of that out and clean all of it i don't know how i'm going to reach that top layer but we'll see and then finally i'll take you down to the last part of the job she said not, not too much pressure on this part because they might be getting rid of it but um it's just a nice decking area now this wood is old um, and a bit flexible, so I'm going to have to be careful I don't fall in. Um, I definitely won't be putting the pressure washer on this because it will go through it. Um, so yeah, obviously when it's wet, this stuff gets so slippy. So we'll try and clear all that the best we can as well. Um, and that's it. So hello to Heidi and Chris for future them that watch this video. This was a YouTube job, so they found my channel um, and then invited me down. I couldn't say no. Look at it. It's amazing. So lovely. All right, I've got a lot of work to do, guys. So I'll get to work right now and enjoy the video.
Whew, running guys, it is hot, <laughs> it is hot, hot today. Um, the drive's done, that's taken a lot longer than I thought. Um, it's just got a bit awkward with the drainage down the side, so yeah, it took a while, but it's done now. I just need to resand it, but I'll do that later. Uh, so, I don't know if you can see the colour of it. Looks lovely. Sorry about the noise, I've just got the aircon on because I am uh, burning up. So I'm starting the back now. Uh, this is def I'm definitely not going to finish this today, I don't think. Um, it, as I said, it's already quarter past one. The customer has bought me lunch. Um, they're like the nicest people ever. Um, and they've even offered to put me up for the night instead of me paying extra money to get a hotel or driving two and a half hours home to do another two and a half hours in the morning. So I always say, guys, I do genuinely have the best customers ever. So yeah, thank you. I'll be taking them up on that offer. So I've never slept at a customer's house before. So <laughs> that's something new, isn't it? Um, They've just moved in, so they just said it's just whatever, just crash anywhere, so. Cool, I'll try my best today. I wanna aim to get the patio finished and I might try and tackle the fountain tomorrow. Either way, it'll all be in this one video, so. Ooh, quick break, have some food, and then we'll get stuck into that patio. day two uh it's about seven in the morning at the moment i had a great sleep it was a really nice bed as well um i was going to get up at six and start resounding the front but it rained like really heavy in the night it was thunderstorming so it's all a bit damp still obviously i don't want to start the pressure off for up to it at least i'm just sitting around for a minute waiting for it to dry out a little bit more and then i'll begin um yeah i had a great sleep can't complain uh thanks again heidi and chris they fed me we had a barbecue and everything awesome really really nice people so uh, yeah, it's been an absolute pleasure, but today let's get this job done and get home. So uh, hang around a little bit more, resound that drive, 
put the hypo down on all the slabs at the back, try and soft wash the things, finish the fountain, do the deck in, and then we're right there, so let's go.
Right then, folks. What's going on with my hair? One second. Um, it's been a long two days, but uh, a fun two days. I've really enjoyed this job, actually. It's been one of my favourite jobs I've done ever. Um, so here's the driveway. Look how good that looks. That's all been resanded. Very, very nice. Really finishes it off when the sun's in it. Look at that. Um, so pretty much now I've just got some like odd bits to do, just a bit of tidy up and stuff. We had a bit of a flood in the garage, which I didn't realise. So I need to <laughs> I need to sort that out and obviously get that sand out of there as well. So if it runs nice and smoothly, luckily there was nothing uh, important there. But yeah, it must have just been splashing under when I was just doing the edges. So that's unfortunate. So I'll dry it out now. I'll sort that out in a minute. Okay, guys, I forgot what I was saying, but. All this came out really nice as well, especially that bit down there. Um, so yeah, buzzing. The only part I'm not as happy about is these balustrades. There's a lot of black spots left on them. Um, so what I'm gonna do, I think I'm coming back anyway, because I've got to quote the neighbor and um, one a little bit further down as well. So I think next time I might bring my VTUF and I might try and see if I can steam these off. That came up lovely. That was uh, really fun to do actually. We're just filling it back up now. Uh, and yeah, look at this water transformation, man. I'm pumped, so I'm gonna pack up now. Sort that garage out and then a two and a half hour drive home so and do my before and after pictures before I go so yeah thanks for watching everyone hope you enjoyed this video uh, thanks again to Heidi and Chris for uh, for having me let me do this job um, and let me stay over and having a barbecue and beers and stuff so yeah it's been awesome so right I'll see you guys very soon nice one